Since 1986, QVC has been a household name in real time interactive home shopping. They're on the air around the clock in more than 350 million households in seven countries, and it all happens from right here in Westchester. Now, being a host on QVC is a pretty unique skill, a live juggle that I got to experience firsthand during a mock sell. And here we Hi. are. Hi, everyone. Hey. It's Alberti. I'm here with my new friend, Alicia Vitarelli uh, this, from 6ABC News. This is so amazing. And what's pretty amazing is that since day one, back in 1986, QVC has been live all day and all night. They joke that they were social media before there even was social media. I wanted to say hi to everyone. Oh, hi. there's Mary Davis. Hi, there's Mary. Zachary. So it only makes sense that while they're live on the air, the hosts are also live on Facebook. And people can actually chime in during our broadcast and ask us their questions live, and we can ask our experts. Being a QVC host, you have to wear a lot of hats. I learned this firsthand when Beauty IQ's Alberti Popage took me along for the ride on a mock sell. First, you're throwing a party for, you know, a few million friends. Hey, beauties, welcome into Beauty IQ. My then you're a teacher. It's all about so show and tell. Yeah, we'll take a look at it. Tell us how it feels. It almost feels like silk. It does feel so like The whole time, the clock is ticking. Got about 30 seconds left, guys. And that's the voice in your ear. And let's make sure we remind everybody what a great value we have. You're getting $136 worth of product home for just $60. It's very interesting what you do because you have to be speaking, listening at the same time. This is real time. It is. And it's live, um, whether it's on television or on Facebook Live. While QVC has certainly evolved over the decades, there's one thing that hasn't changed a bit beyond the bells and whistles, beyond the latest technology, the Hollywood style sets. This is simply about human interaction. Just everyday people talking to each other, making a connection, and really sharing great stories. And I think that that's what QVC does so well. His job's pretty tough, I tell you. This summer, the parent company of QVC announced it's buying its rival home shopping network for a $2.6 billion deal. And by the way, it's the size of 12 football fields there in Westchester. It's like its own city. Pretty amazing, you guys.